we start with the Eskimo Bros versus the Reefa Sticks. The difference in this one came down to the quarterbacks. Russell Wilson's 37 points was 26 points better than Aaron Rodgers' 11 points. You done messed up, A.A. Hey, Ron! In week 10, the Reefa Sticks will try to avenge their last second week one loss to Vanilla Gorilla. You know what they say? Revenge is like serving cold cuts. I don't think it means what you think it means. Next, we have the Skins vs. Red Eyes Revenge. This was a low-scoring affair, but the Skins still managed to get the win and remain on top of the standings. The Patriots' defense finally had an off game, but Christian McCaffrey did not as he put up 36 points. Damn! Next up, it's the Dude Abides vs. Finger Puppet Mafia. Another low-scoring game here with two of the worst teams battling for positioning in the Toilet Bowl playoffs. And that's all I have to say about that. Next, we have the travesty of the week with the Moose Knuckles facing Vanilla Gorilla. This is the second week in a row that the Moose Knuckles have put up over 130 points, only to be matched up with the high score for the week. This is bullshit. Finally, we have the Coldies vs. Money Inc. This was a close one as Money Inc. held on for a one-point victory. The Coldies are kicking themselves for leaving Kenyon Drake and his 26 points on the bench. Come on, 